Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This is a BMS 14S 30 amp. I have everybody said that this is a 48 volt. Okay, so it's 14S 48 volt. So I have everybody set already. So I have to go and set it up and test it. And this is a Bluetooth device. This is a Bluetooth. So we're going to be testing this and see if it works. Hopefully it works. And this, this BMS has a has a sensor. We're going to try it. We're going to check the sensor if it works. And right now, I got to clean this thing up and put the, the, ring, the ring connector. Put the ring connector on it and do the same thing on the other one. And go plug the wires. So I'll show you guys how to set this thing up. Hopefully, this day, this video doesn't take that long. I have the ring connector put on. I, put, I did a nice job in this one. This one I messed it up, but I can fix it up later. But for the time being, I just thought, I'm just trying to make it work. Okay, so now I'm gonna plug it in. Uh, go to the battery. And I'll show you guys how I do this. Now this is the battery that I have. It's about it's a hundreds. I have two of them in parallel. It's a two P fourteen S two P fourteen S. And on the other I have five wires in here. I have five. I have a fifteen wires in here. Okay. So what I'm gonna do? This is the main negative. You can see some wires already preset there. That's for a different BMS. That's that's another video. So I'm gonna still hook up this BMS in here. I just follow the pattern and I'm gonna put it in the middle. I'm gonna try to put something right in the middle so therefore I can reach, I can, I can reach the BMS. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna wire, I'm gonna wire, I'm gonna plug this wire on this, on the, on the, on the, on the, on the terminals and follow the whole thing and hope when i'm done i'll show you guys how this thing look like i want to tell you guys before i tie i tied everything up to the to the to the bottom of the battery now the reason i don't put a ring connector in here because i'm going to use the same wire to make it longer so therefore i don't use a tower on top of it and this is for only test purposes if I was going to do it, if you, I will have an update video on how I have this BMS. How I have this BMS on a, on a bigger system using the same BMS. But I will not using it to charge or discharge. I will use the, this BMS only to monitor the battery. So I got to test it. That's why I don't put the ring nuts in here. I'm going to make the wires longer. I make the wires longer for for the for this purpose. I'm only I leave it the way it is. I'm gonna tight. I'm gonna unscrew this, unscrew this, and put uh, put the wire there, and do the same thing for every single one of them. That's the only reason I'm doing that. That way. Now all the wires been put been been placed. Okay. First negative, first positive, I mean main negative, first positive, second, second wire, um, third wire, fourth, fifth, right there, six, seven, Seven, eight, nine, ten. This is eleven. Eleven. I think the twelve is right there. Thirteen. And the fourteen. So this is good to go. Now. My BMS is a, where's the BMS? 
because this wire cannot reach so I have to put a towel or something to protect the batteries something heavy so there won't be no connection so that's why I found this towel I'm gonna put it right there now the only thing we're gonna see in front is the wires now it's always good to double check the wires so I put this towel now you don't see no 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 you don't see the battery I can put this thing on the flat because I need the the positive so I'm gonna flip it so my wire was put just like flipping also so I gotta bring that connection here I don't think I have enough can this thing reach so let's see if this thing can reach I think it can reach we can manage to tight this one so I'm gonna unscrew that screw that wire back in there to get the positive the negative of the battery and this will go from there if it doesn't I can use in an extension okay the wire was too short but usually I find a connection I put a black wire there the way this it's already connected so now I have to plug this thing I only have one hand so that's why I can't show you guys I'm gonna try let me see if I can do that I can plug it if there's a spark I don't think there will be any spark because I've done this thing too many times I will not make a mistake like this this is in three times already on the same battery I'll just plug the wires everything would fit now I can check if I have I can check if I have connection right now there's no no smelling stuff so nothing burned so I have the negative of the battery of the BMS this is the negative and this is the positive so I come as a problem now all the wires are set so let me go over that with you guys again I have the negative here this is the wire going to the the BMS and this is the positive there's another positive there that's the first one that's the second one second one third one fourth fifth six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen and 14 so I use the B minus to plug it in on this and the and this and this on the main negative now this is the wire I'm gonna use for the inverter right now I don't need the inverter I need the Bluetooth so I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys something on the Bluetooth next time you do this don't panic no no panic because I was a little bit panic earlier you see the Bluetooth, even if it's connected, it will go through. Okay. This is this one, this way. Now you see the light flashing and then it stop. Okay, so what I th thought it was, this thing is broken, but it is not broken because there's no no Bluetooth, no no software connected to it, and this is why it does this. Okay, don't be panicking. <clears throat> now, let me. There's my normal routine to see if this thing works. If there's no fire, it works. And you always do. You always check. To see if you got voltage. Okay. I always check to see if you got voltage. Now take uh, the positive to the main bone of the battery. Plug it in here. Okay. And take the negative and touch this negative here. If I get voltage, do I have voltage? Oh, the wire come off. 
Let's try this thing again. This thing fell down. Okay, stay there. Okay, I got 50.8. That's what I had earlier. This is what it is. Okay. Now what I'm doing is download the software. I'm going to show you guys what I did. Okay, download the software. You go to Google app. And then you look for the software. It's shown up here. This is it. And you install it. <coughs> I'm going to show you guys my mistake, what I did. Okay, it's installed. Open. I allow. And then the connection come in. So I connect. It asks for your password. The password is one two three five six. I have to go online to get it. The password is one two three four five six. Confirm. It said use GPS to test it. Don't know what does that mean. I said no. Now it tells me the voltage. It tells me I have 41. This is the voltage of the battery. The average of voltage is 3.61, which I already know. I check all the batteries and this is what this thing gave me. And when I go there, nothing. Just only read the battery for you. Now I try my best to make my video as good as possible because I'm going to the same thing. This is not the right software. Don't go to Google Play and get that software. This doesn't this only read the body for you. It doesn't give you any nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, that's all. When you press this thing, there's nothing there. There's nothing. It just read the body for you. You don't get to change no parameters, nothing. You can press this thing. This doesn't do anything. So I gotta install the battery. I gotta re re uh, uninstall the battery. Now let me tell you guys where I found this software. I went to this site, this one, where my finger is. It's a third party software. That's where I download this.
What I did, I went after I downloaded it, I went to the folder that download thing there and unzip it. And that's it. And we're going to do the process. The software will be in there. Install. The things install. Now you open it. You're allowed. It's going to automatically look at it. It does this. You go back. Go back out completely. You're going to see it in there. Actually, for the password, as you know, password is one, two, three, four, five, six. Confirm. I do not know what this thing means. Hundreds at, I think I already said it, but I don't know what capacity means. Capacity cycling. I'm just guessing. It's 120. Let's say 100. Confirm. This is the software. The other one didn't did show you this. Now this is the whole software. The battery is still the same. I got this battery, the fourth, the fourteenth one. It's very high. It came like this. You gotta remember this is grade 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 C or grade B cells, so they're not that strong. I'm at fifth point five voltage. Now, if I go back there where the battery is, you will see the the the, the Bluetooth light come on. This is the power meter. When you go to the menu, you got all these things. This is not the admin section. I do not know how to find the admin section, give you more, more, more way of doing things. So this is the battery. I'm at 54 voltage. Basically, you guys got to go through this current. I am not, sorry about that. Capacity remaining. I do not know where I got the capacity. How many times cycling, manufacture. The average says to 3.6, 14S. Basically, this is it. So, you guys have to learn to do this. I probably have another video for you guys when I set more than one pack of battery. Right now I have one pack which is having about 20, I got 14, for 2P I got 28 cell back there. Now I'm going to have at least multiple cells and not only 28, I'm going to have the same type of battery. I'm going to have um, 56 cell together. On the same BMS, I'm gonna only be using the BMS to monitor the battery. If something is not moving well, that's what I'm gonna be using the BMS for. I'm gonna discharge it separate on a different BMS. I will be show you guys this video some other time. That will conclude this video. Stay, stay tuned, subscribe, and like and share.